making our own something play. And so we're gonna do that. Welcome, Welcome to, to the Bear, Bear Fam, Fam Show. Everybody. Hi everybody. Welcome to Make Something Monday. Today we're gonna look at how to inflate balloons and how to make the best way to inflate. Which one should we blow up first? Uh, this one. What color is it? Blue. All right, we'll blow it up. So that's one way to blow up balloons. But you have to ask yourself, is that really hard? I mean, Lodi Bear, can you blow up a balloon? Huh? Blow up a balloon. I can't. You can't, right? So let's look at different ways to blow up balloons. One. Way number two, two is we found these at the dollar store. They're Happy Easter balloons. Well, first, you're going to open them. And these ones, get it right there. Found it. It's blowing up by itself. You see it? You see it, Lucky Bear? What's happening? And that's as big as it gets, which is kind of cool, but a little disappointing by the size. Well, there's another way that I'm sure you guys have seen the YouTube videos. So let's go ahead and do one of those. All right, so first you're gonna need a mixture of half water, half vinegar. We use 50 milliliters of vinegar and 50 milliliters of hot water. Next, we're gonna fill the balloon halfway with baking soda. Look at there, what is this? Egg! This is an egg? Yeah. What is it? Water. Water and vinegar. Why is water and vinegar in there? Do you want to find out? Okay. So we filled our balloon halfway with baking soda. Maybe we'll go that way. Or we And you put it on top of the bottle, tip the balloon over, pour it in there, hold it. And that's pretty cool. Look at that. It blew up pretty big. So after doing that, we were thinking, let's mix it too. Let's make our own something inflatable balloon. And so we're going to do that. To make our own inflatable balloon, first we have to put our ingredients together. So just like the water bottle video that we just showed, or the water bottle example we just showed you, we're going to use water and vinegar. We're going to put it in a water balloon. So I'm going to put half water, half vinegar, put a water balloon on top, poke the hole in the cap. <laughs> now I'm just gonna squeeze it in there. Alright, so we put the vinegar and water in this water balloon, and next we're gonna put it inside this balloon. Um, it's gonna take two of us, so we're gonna stop recording for a little bit, and uh, when we come back, it'll be in there. Alright, so we got the water balloon in there. Definitely, definitely very hard. What you have to do, you have to stretch one open, get your fingers all the way down towards the bottom. It's actually in the chamber, and have somebody else pick it in. Really hard. Look at here, don't pop it, leave it. <laughs> We're gonna pop it a little bit, okay? <laughs> all right, so the next shot, you have to insert the funnel into the balloon so you can put the baking soda. Uh, I blow it up first a little bit so there's a little air in there. So the uh, baking powder from the bottom. So I'm gonna blow it up. And Mommy Bear's gonna help me put the funnel on the balloon. Lucky Bear, you wanna watch? Yeah. Okay, watch. No, you don't Said in the first Mesa Big Monday, craft table's meant to get dirty. <laughs> Alright, 
And that should be enough. Then you just let the flake. Hopefully without getting too much powder out. So let's be honest, we already got powder everywhere. So this is the end result. It's a balloon full of powder and a water balloon full of water and vinegar. Now Logan Bear is gonna hit it really hard, hopefully breaking the water balloon and expanding it. Logan Bear, hit it really hard. Hit it again, hit it again. Good job. So, in conclusion, <laughs> blowing up a balloon is a lot easier yeah. than what we just did. Is it more fun? Maybe not. <laughs> <laughs> See, a lot more fun. Alright, everybody, let's say goodbye. Alright, right, everybody, if you liked our video, please give us a thumbs up. Give a thumbs up, Logie Bear. And please subscribe for more videos. Bye! Bye.